Here's how to check if your Android phone is hacked. Now, the first thing we're gonna do is swipe up from here and tap on the settings icon. And from here, let's just scroll down and tap on the battery option. From here, all we're gonna do is scroll down until we get to the battery usage. Let's hit view details from here. And we're gonna go through this list of everything that has used your battery in the last couple of days. Check to see if there are apps on here that you don't recognize that you didn't open and use, but it said it did use your phone's battery. So you can always open up that app and see more information about it. If you don't recognize something on here, make sure to delete it. The next thing we'll do is hop out of here and we'll open up the phone app. You're gonna to check to see if there are incoming or outgoing calls that you don't recognize. If there are, that's a good indication someone might have hacked into your phone. We'll do the same thing for messages. Check to see if there are any messages, incoming or outgoing, that you didn't send. Just tap on a few of the recent ones and make sure you sent all of those messages. Someone else random didn't send them for you. The next thing we'll do is we'll go back into your settings. So swipe up and tap on settings again. And let's just go back out of here. So keep going back to the very beginning. And once we're on the very beginning, we're gonna scroll down to the bottom and tap on software update and download and install. The first thing you're gonna do is this will check in with Android to see if there's everything is good to go. It will show you if there's an update available. Otherwise, it will show you your security patch level. You wanna make sure that is a recent security patch and there's not something that doesn't say any security patch or it's a long time ago. The last thing I would recommend doing is heading into the Google Play Store and we'll just hit search and we'll search for virus uh, on here. Let's just search virus. And on here, you can see a bunch of different options. This one, AVG antivirus is a good one. You can download and install any of these different ones and then just hit the scan now button. Let's hit okay and give it permission. And now once we go back here, it will go through the process of scanning your entire phone for viruses.